went to the gym today. My complex has one. And we've been here almost a year. And this is my first time going to the gym. And I didn't go today because of weight loss reasons, which as you can see, I need to be in here for weight loss reasons, but I look sloppy, y'all, I'm sorry. But I came today for mental health. I have been having a really hard time with anxiety, depression, bipolarness, and I'm so wrapped up in going to work, making sure my family is okay, making sure, you know, my dogs are okay, which is part of my family, but making sure everybody else is okay. And I forgot about me. I forgot about me. And in the midst of that, you know, um, you have gained some weight. I've lost some weight. Um, but mentally, I'm not okay. And it's okay to say it's not okay, or it's okay to be not okay. You know, I don't know the words, but what I can say is that I'm not okay. And, you know, um, every day seems to be getting harder. Um, I'm mentally tired. I'm uh, mentally, more mentally exhausted. <clears throat> um, my job plays a really big role in that. And um, I don't know, like, I thought moving and, you know, having a, a great paying job and living where you always wanted to live and, you know, it would somehow help me mentally, but it has only made it worse, right? Um, but today, I got up this morning, I got up, I was going to lay around for a little bit, but I got up. And I walked a minute and a half to our gym. And I did an hour on the treadmill. To most, you're probably saying, do more. But to me, and to anyone who has been in my shoes or are in my shoes right now, understand how hard it was for me just to do this today. Um, and halfway through that hour, I wanted to give up because I am continuously giving up on myself, right? <laughs> Everything I've started for me, I've stopped. Every dream I've had for me, I talked myself out of it. And, but my video stopped, but I, I am proud of me for today. I am proud that I got up and I didn't mope around and I didn't, you know, lay around and then beat myself up later in the day. And um, because I didn't come to the gym or I didn't do something that I said I was gonna do for me. And you guys just don't know how proud of me I am of just getting up and doing this hard task. And, um, Whoever needs to hear this today, I am proud of you. I am proud of you. I'm proud of you trying. I'm proud of you getting up and keep going when you know that you want to give up. I am proud of your accomplishments. I'm a proud, I'm a proud, I'm proud of, of you. And I, seem, I feel lost for words because I'm looking for words to, that I need to hear and to share those words for you and sadly to say I don't have enough words for me. And that's how it's always been for me. I've always not had enough for me. I've always been too tired of taking care of everyone else and I get put on the back burner. And I'm not blaming anyone for my weight issues. I'm not blaming anyone for any fails that I've had or any dreams that I had that I did not try. I'm blaming me. You know, I'm, I'm tired of everyone pointing a finger at everyone else or, and I mean, I'm speaking for me, y'all, not for nobody else. I'm speaking for me. I'm tired of trying to find 
a reason on why I gave up on me. And the only reason is because of me. It's because of me. So today, I got up, I did an hour on the treadmill, um, and I'm gonna go get my day started. I'm gonna go shower, do some errands, come back and spend some time with me and the Lord and my dogs, and just continue in this, this happy feeling that I feel. So if anybody needs to, to get up or need a little boost of energy, just know you can. I did. So you can. You come first. You matter. No matter what.